briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1927, the Supreme Court of the United States heard the case of Whitney v. California, which centered on the constitutionality of the Criminal Syndicalism Act of California. The plaintiff, who had been found guilty of violating the act, argued that the law deprived her of her legal rights and went against the Constitution's guarantee of a fair trial and equal treatment. The Criminal Syndicalism Act targeted those who advocated, taught, or aided activities involving violence or terrorism in order to achieve industrial ownership or political change. The defendant was charged with organizing, assisting, and becoming a member of an organization promoting criminal syndicalism. In the judgment delivered by Mr. Justice Sanford, the Supreme Court held that the act was constitutional and the defendant's arguments were invalid. The court found that the law clearly defined illegal behavior and did not unfairly infringe on people's freedom of speech. As a result, the court upheld the defendant's conviction. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.